Abracadabra, bitch. Harry Potter, you have to say Dumbledore. But I'm just, I'm just Harry. No, Harry, you fucking can't be a wizard. But I'm just Harry Potter. I'm Harry Potter. No, you fuck. You no, you, you fucking can't listen. I'm just Harry. Yeah. Okay, this is fucking stupid. Hey. Hey guys, my name is Matters, and today I'm reading your comments. Look out, here they come. Oh shit, did you see that? It was a comment just flew by, I gotta go catch it. Gotta catch the co comment. It flew into this painting. Just like me, here we go. Uh, I'm just kidding, I'm not, I'm not gonna jump into the painting. But that would be funny though, be good uh, be good magic trick. <sighs> All right. Today we're gonna be reading the comments for the 500 subscribers that we've gained over the past, I think it's been two years on this channel. Now, a lot of people will be like, hey, 200, uh, 500 subscribers, two years, that's no big deal, man. I could do that. Well, guess what? You probably could, but that's not what's important. What is important though is that we I don't care about your I don't give a fuck. I my dance. Fucking yeet! Let's get into the comments. So the first comment is from Liam Hedger, and he says, Are you a virgin? <laughs> Let me ask you something. Does this look like a fucking virgin to you? <laughs> Would a virgin have the complete collection of Avatar books 1 through 4? I don't think so. <laughs> me, a virgin? <laughs> Would a virgin film YouTube videos in his room by himself? Come on. Would, would, would a fucking virgin still play Pokemon Fire Red on fucking Game Boy? Don't think so. Huh. Oh shit, no, stop. And the next question comes from Sounds Epic. Will you always be a meme boy? Even when you're old with gray hair and a wrinkly face? Well, I don't know. Would I always be a meme boy? Yeah, yeah, I think I... Uh, yeah. Alright, next question! Chris loves games! Boy, you still leaving comments? Let me tell you something, Chris. I appreciate you 100%. If I could give you a thousand dollars, I would. But, I can't. So he says, honestly, my question is, how old are you? And he said, my guess is that you're 19. I'm actually 22. I look way younger than I actually am. But I guess that's a good thing, because when I get old, I won't be like fucking old and saggy, right? I mean, I hope so. <laughs> I'm gonna get old. And the next question comes from next. Stream, he says, what were your thoughts when you created your YouTube channel and why you made one? Honest question from your boy. I'll be reading for it to be read. And here we are. It is going to be read today. All right. Let me give you guys kind of a little backstory on Matters Game. So Matters Game actually started after my first channel. What? You had another channel? Yeah, I did, dude. I've had three so far. Well, technically f I've been on four, but I've had three. The first uh, channel that I ever made, it was going good, you know, it wasn't going good. So the first channel that I ever made only got up to 100 subscribers within the first year. I was very upset with that channel. I didn't really like what I was doing. I was posting almost every single day, but I would post two videos a day. The videos that I would post is I would post gaming and then I would post vlogs. I like doing the gaming way better than I like doing vlogs and also I felt kind of stressed out trying to put out two videos a day. Instead what I did was I started a brand new channel and I called it Matters Game. Now on Matters Game, that whole channel was just video games. That's it. Now that one did really good actually. That one blew up within the first year. It got like 2,000 something subs but unfortunately uh, I had given up on that channel for an entire year. I kind of just stopped doing it. After that I was like well I can't really come back to my old channel. And so what I did was I decided, you know what? 
forget it. I'm gonna start brand new, fresh, and I'm gonna have great content every single time I post. My whole goal with this channel is if I don't feel like my content is good enough to be posted, I'm not gonna post it. I only post things that I think people will actually like. These kind of videos are a little bit different. Of course, the only people watching this are gonna be you guys who actually are excited to watch my channel, excited to see me grow, and the people who are part of the community are the people who are gonna be watching this right now. If you are watching this, I would like to thank you so much because the only reason why I keep motivated about this channel is the fact that you guys come back to watch my videos. Really, that's the only reason why I'm actually making this video right now. It's been about two weeks since I uploaded my last one. I've been in kind of a funk recently. I've been kind of down with making videos. I haven't been very excited. But then I looked back and then I read over all of your comments and you know, it just, it, every time I do read comments, it always makes me feel like I have a reason to actually keep doing YouTube. If you guys didn't watch, if you guys didn't comment, I probably wouldn't enjoy doing it. I would just be making videos and nobody would be watching them. But why did I make one? Why, why did I make a YouTube channel? Well, I just like doing it. I just like interacting with people. I just like seeing people's reactions. My biggest thing is that I really love doing crazy stuff and acting crazy, weirding people out, just because I've always done that since I was a little kid. I've always been like super weird. So getting people's reactions on what I do is what I like to do. I like to see what people think. Unfortunately, though, some people, some people, some people aren't, some people aren't, aren't that nice. And uh, if you're not nice, uh, you can, you can suck a big old. Chris says, Chris, not Chris loves games. That's a different Chris. We're talking about Chris Kim. He says. He's got 400 subs now. Shouts out to Chris Kim. You need to keep making videos. You do have a lot of potential. Keep doing what you're doing. Guys, if you want to go follow Chris Kim, I'm going to leave his link in the description. Dab on them hoes. YouTube gang for life. And I'll see you at VidCon next year. Shit, son of a- Okay. And the age old question has arised. Are you gay? You know, I've always felt a little gay, but at the same time, I've always felt like I'm 100% a lesbian, so, you know, I don't really know uh, what that leads me at. You know, I might be, uh, might be a dude who likes girls, which would make me a lesbian. <laughs> no, I'm not. No, but for real though, like seriously, I, I, I don't get it. I mean, I guess, I guess because I'm weird and I do YouTube and I comb my hair and I shave my face and I try to try to dress nice sometimes but not today that was supposed to be a freeze frame of of my pants I don't even know if you could see them I it probably blurred out a really badly or something <laughs> last question the very last question of the day guys is from drumroll Bazamalama, do you enjoy the act of eating homeless people's clothing? What clothes? <laughs> Am I right? Ha! <laughs> Got him. Got him. Got him. <laughs> Got him. God fucking ah. ah! Anyways. That's it. That was the last question. Thank you guys again for 500 subscribers. This is so amazing. I'm so glad that people still like to watch what I make. I put a lot of work into my videos. Sometimes I get demotivated, but at the end of the day, I will never stop uploading. And it's because of everybody who was a part of this video. It's because of everybody who subscribed. It's because of everybody that I will be at a million subscribers one day. <laughs> <laughs> but that only happens with content. With that being said, guys, I would like to thank you so much for watching this video. There's going to be more in the future, so don't leave. Don't go anywhere. Matters Game will be right back with another one. The next question is fucking yeet! <laughs>